Hey everyone, Gil here at Camp Patton Family Compound. I got a new toy here to show you. I already showed my um, channel members. Alright, so I aim it at the door here if I get it right so it doesn't do it. Alright, so it's 58 degrees, middle of the door. I move it down, temperature drops. Bottom of the door is colder because uh, hot air rises in here. So we have 55 degrees inside. All right. And oh, we got the gap of cold air coming in around the door there a little bit. Look at that. So let's go outside here and do a little checking around outside here. <sighs> okay. So if I aim at the door again. We get aimed right here, middle of the door again, and we're gonna. Okay, it's in about four degrees. If I go down, minus nine degrees because the door is warmer at the top because of the warm air from the inside trying to get out. So we get down to about ten degree minus ten degrees there. But aim over here. Or we got minus 17, that's because the insulation keeping the warmth inside is greater. So 17 there. But let's look at something else here. Got the, uh, right there. So I'm going to aim at the side of that. Okay. 20 there. 19.20. 19 19.8 to 20. On the back side here, does it go down anymore? No, okay. Now I want to go over to the shop door. The light's going to come on and blind us here in a second. There we go. So aim at the shop door. Minus 13. Minus 17. So there is some warmth in the shop. Is out there working on it, but yeah. So, we've got plenty, and if I just look at the snow here, get it here, snow showing same temperature. So, yeah, basically it's minus 20 here, unless you're a building. So, let's get back inside where it's warm. Oh, yes. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to turn that off and lock the door to keep that draft from coming in here. So yeah, this is a pretty neat little tool here. I've been testing it out inside and everything, and uh, been post post a couple shorts over there on Gray Man prepping with it. But uh, I took a break for my live stream over there. So yeah, this works out pretty good. Gives me the reading, gives me a max reading automatically for the, for the if I do several in a row here. Hey guys, for laugh and giggles, I thought I'd bring this into the into the living room where we got the fireplace going. First thing I'm going to aim over at the wood here. I get it. So 77 is what the wood pile is there. And over here farther, farther away from the stove it cools off. And right now the... Alright, we've got almost 500 degrees that uh, glass on the front. And there it keeps climbing. Bounces around as the heat goes. And the pot up on top here. And get, the pot reflects, so it's not going to give a good heat. Let me just aim down at the top of this of area. So I'm not hitting the fire, I'm just hitting the surface on top here. So it says about three, eh, mid threes there. Of course, the uh, fans are there spinning around. I'll try by aiming just into the water here, see what I get. Okay, the water is uh, kind of simmering, There's a lot of steam coming off of it, so. Anyways, some more playing around here with the, uh, it. let's try the far side here, see what, just at the side of it along here. Because there's a, this here, it should be cooler because it has the, it's the uh, vent wall, I mean a vent wall. It's a dual wall here that has a uh, airstream flowing between it. To blow air out into the room so 
Yeah, that means hopefully it'll start heating up the house there again. While I was on my live stream, I let the fire die out. So, alrighty. See you around.